Well, it's uh, time for your weekly performance evaluation. Why don't you uh, give me a rundown on everything that you did this week? Uh, you expect me to do this every week? Report to you? Yeah. I was kind of hoping it was more of a monthly thing or a biannual thing. Mm, no, this is going to be a weekly thing. Okay, well, don't expect me to be on time. Oh, yeah, I am your commanding officer. So yeah, you know. but I don't care. I Shopkeep, I am heading out and I need some supplies. I won't make any trouble for the gang. Just let me keep my store and I'll cut you a little discount. Excellent. Works out well for everybody. All right. Now, you say this is a shotgun? What's been going on in the wasteland? Same old shit that's been going on for years. The NCR and Legion are still fighting over Hoover Dam for some reason. What do you know of the NCR? Just a bunch of people with money and power pushing everyone else around. Yeah. They've got troops all over the Mojave. But it's a big desert. So it's pretty easy to avoid them if you want. It's also easy to isolate them and pick them off one by one. But I wouldn't know anything about that. What do you know of the Legion? I've run with some tough gangs. But I gotta admit, they all got nothing on the Legion. I hear they stick you up on poles and it takes a while to die. I ain't saying I'm afraid of them or nothing. But I'll be staying out of their way. It's called the Crucifixion and it takes about three days to die of dehydration. Not that I would know. I do believe you mentioned a correctional facility run by powder gangers. I might head out there and see if there's any work for me. Yeah. Yeah, not a bad idea. See you around. Aha! This must be it. Yes, the correctional facility. This is, or was, the big house. New California Republic Correctional Facility. Not much correcting went on here. Just slave labor. One day... Us prisoners decided to liberate ourselves. Killed the warden, killed the guards, took over the whole damn territory. You should let me in. Yeah, all right. Figure you could help us out the way you helped out Cobb's crew over in Good Springs. Who's in charge around here? That'll be Eddie. You can usually find him sitting in the warden's old chair up in the main building. Eddie, huh? I think I'll go talk to that person. Yeah, whatever. Yes. So a bunch of slaves freed themselves... Took out their masters, and now they're in control. Don't you start getting any ideas. It's about time a new customer showed up around here. I was getting sick of dealing with the same faces all the time. Ah, you don't seem like Eddie. You're a traitor of sorts? I was always the guy who could get things, if you know what I mean. Figured I might as well keep on doing it. Ah, yes, the guy who was able to smuggle things in through his rectum. A valuable member of the prison community. Why are you sticking around here? Don't have any other place to go. I'd just end up back in another prison or dead out in the wasteland. Well, if you ever feel the inclination to leave, Good Springs is under Powder Ganger rule. Heard there was a new face around. I'm the doctor around here. Sort of. Well, I do need a little bit of patching up. Wait, you said you're the doctor? I was an NCR medic for six months, so I'm not exactly a doctor. Still, it's more medical training than any of the other guys here. It also gives me an excuse to stay out of any raiding parties. The gang can't lose its only doctor now, can it? You say you were a medic in the NCR army? Medical supplies go for a decent amount of caps in the right markets. I figured the quartermaster wouldn't notice any missing. I was wrong. Ah, uh, thievery. If there's one thing the Legion and the NCR can agree on, it's that thieves will not be tolerated. What are you looking at? What's your role around here? I keep an eye on my buddy Eddie. Anybody messes with him and I scramble them real good. Ah, that's why you're called Scrambler. It's because I mess up people so bad they don't know what part goes where when I'm done. Yes, we all do what we must to help out the team. Dawes said he let somebody in. So you going to give me a reason not to kill you and throw your body back outside? I'm the kind of man who can get things done. This is Powder Ganger territory. My territory. Most of the guys around here understand that. One, Chavez doesn't. Chavez formed his own crew and have been hitting traitors on their own. Everybody I've sent after him either got killed or weren't able to catch him. That leaves you. What do you say? One rogue soldier? I think I can take care of that. Good. Chavez and his boys were last seen south of here. If you're lucky and he's careless, he might still be there. I make my own luck, and I'm sure they make their own carelessness. You just walked into the wrong camp, my friend. Hand over everything you've got and we might let you live. The only person at risk here is you. Eddie sent me. 
That's nothing new. Am I supposed to be impressed? Ah! Run! Eddie, where are we going? We going on a field trip? Come on. Pardon you. I realize that we're Legion and all, but I can't help but think that you might be playing with your enemies before you kill them. You're comparing me to a cat? I don't eat these gangsters, I'll have you know. They're too gamey for my tastes. Let's, let's just keep going, shall we? Yes, let's. Good news, Eddie. I've been thinking that since you've been good to us, we can be good to you. We've got plenty of spare powder and dynamite around. Say the word and we can give you some of it every couple days. That little issue with Chavez has been dealt with. I'm happy you cleared that up for me. But we've got another situation to worry about. There's a merchant hanging around near the prison. Something feels funny about him and I want you to deal with him. Shake him down if he's legit, but if not, take him out. Shaking down a random merchant seems beneath me. Most people already know we run this territory and are usually in a hurry to get out. Not this guy. It's like he wants us to come get him. You think he is bait, do you? That might be worth looking into. What do we have here? A traveling merchant? How useful! I am in need of supplies. Better be careful around these parts. I hear there's powder gangers around and dangerous for merchants like me. It's true, this is powder ganger territory, which is why it's so confusing you don't have any guards. Guess I was a little too obvious. I'm actually a bounty hunter. I was hoping to bag some powder gangers if they tried to rob me. Did somebody put a bounty out on any specific powder ganger? No, but there ought to be. I'm just taking the initiative is all. So you're not a bounty hunter, you're just a vigilante. It's dangerous to take in the powder gangers, especially by yourself. I was a caravan guard, so I know how to handle a gun pretty well. You better leave while you can. The powder gangers are smarter than you think. They might hire a contractor to deal with you. Yeah, was a stupid idea anyway. See you around. Okay, maybe you're not as stupid as you look. Eddie, I bring you news. I'll leave it up to you, decide if it's good or not. What? It's been dealt with. Good. Had him figured for NCR. One of the rangers, maybe. Anyway, speaking of the NCR, I need you to take a walk down to Prim. The NCR hasn't raised hell over our breakout, and I want to find out why. They're up to something, I can feel it. I hear they're stretched thin. Not enough personnel. But if you're concerned, I'm concerned. I know the NCR has troops near Prim, so talk to the locals and find out if any of those troops are going to be coming our way. It will be done. Yeah, get out of here. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. Off limits? What's going on? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. Oh yes, I don't want to deal with any powder gangers. I should go back to Good Springs. But I'm here on business. I can take care of myself. It's your ass. Don't say you weren't warned. The NCR is so charming, I can't believe they haven't won over more hearts and minds around here. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. If you want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. I don't know if I should be going up the chain of command that far. I have a small issue I want to talk to you about. It's the prison north of here. Does the NCR have any plans for taking it back from the gangers? I have no idea. I just go and do what they tell me. Very helpful, thank you. Maybe I will go over your head after all. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? The powder gangers are becoming a real threat, taking over city after city. The brass is familiar with the situation at the NCRCF. Are they going to let it fester, or are they going to do something about it? Military operations are classified information. I think that's all the help I'm going to get from you. Sir? I suppose not every NCR soldier is going to be a complete moron, but if there are any plans to attack the correctional facility, they've probably already assured the locals. Maybe if we talk to them, we can figure out what they're planning. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. Yes, I can see that. Is the NCR going to do anything about it? I might know something, but my memory ain't what it used to be. Sometimes it needs motivating. Do I seem like the kind of person who's going to ask twice? 
No need to get upset, youngster. We're all friends here. Oh, yes. I swore not to say a word to no one, but an NCR deserter passed through some days ago and traded for supplies. According to him, the NCR has decided enough's enough and is going to send in a mess of troops to take back the prison any day now. And this is why you don't allow deserters to live. Sounds like the NCR does have a plan. Don't know if they're going to enact it anytime soon. And it doesn't seem like we've got any specific details. But let's return and brief Eddie nevertheless. What? Hey, Eddie, you've got trouble. The NCR is planning to raid this place... soon. Sounds like they're already here. There's no way I'm letting them take me alive. That was fast. There's no reason for you to stick around and help us, but feel free to kill a few of the bastards on your way out. Okay, <laughs> well... Uh, sorry I couldn't have brought that information to your attention any sooner. I'll just be slipping out now. Oh! Oh, looks like they're breaking through that left wall. That looks like I'm taking a way out here then. Or there's NCR. Okay, we're ducking back in. We are ducking back in. Step one, set a booby trap by the front door. So the moment they walk through that door, they explode. My plan has no flaws, unless they come in one by one. Uh, question, does the NCR have trickle tactics, or do they usually move as a unit? Because if they move as a unit, they might get blown up as a unit. But if they move in one by one, I feel like we're going to blow our load all at once. We're just going to back away from that. You like that? Why like don't that? we let these guys handle it? Uh, if the NCR comes looking for powder gangers, we're not associated with them at all. No, they captured us. We are innocent traitors. And they were gonna do terrible things to the both of us. Ooh, yeah, that's a believable story, right? Yeah, yeah, this will work. This will work. So, you... I know this is coming. I knew you were gonna criticize me for this. You decided not to run headfirst into glorious battle. I know, I wish I could have committed a suicidal attack like every other Legion soldier, but I had so many things I needed to do. To be fair, we do have a lot of less intelligent soldiers who are more than capable of running face first into suicidal attacks. Yeah. And I would prefer to have you alive. I just, you know. Oh, the feeling's mutual. I love you too, buddy. I'm sorry, I just get excited when I think of the concept of running face first into <laughs> glorious combat. Oh, don't we all? Well, I'll let it slide this time, but you better go face first into glorious combat next time, you little weasel. <laughs> I promise. Did any of them breach the perimeter? I thought I heard one of them get upstairs, but maybe not. Oh. Looks like Scrambler took care of them. And you did that with your fists, did you? Oh my goodness, yes. Like shooting fish in a barrel, that trap was so effective. A couple of powder gangers got caught in that, but not all of them. Uh, just, just, quick, quick question. Um, the doctor didn't happen to survive, did he? Why do you ask? Kaiser's got this... Problem that uh, never, never mind. Don't worry about it. It, it. He's dead. It's fine. It's fine. What was that about Kaiser though? No, nothing. Nothing. I didn't say anything. You sure? Yeah, I, I didn't say anything. I was just talking about um, you know, uh, I wanted to know if he was still alive because I got a uh, itchy butt, but itchy, itchy butt rash. Oh boy, I envy your slaves. <laughs> Not half bad in a fight, are you? I figure you had a lot to do with me still breathing after all that. I don't have any more work for you, but feel free to stick around as long as you want. You never know when the NCR will be back. I'd love to stick around, but I took a couple of bullet wounds, and your doctor is now dead. So it's probably best if I move on. An entire platoon of NCR soldiers, dead. And the nefarious powder gangers, still draining them of resources. Yes, I think without sarcasm we can say it's been a good day. So your ultimate plan was to just keep the powder gangers around so they just keep being a drain on the NCR? Yep, great plan, right? That's a good plan. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah. Oh, on a side note, 
Do you think you could get that picture of President Peaches? I'll see what I can do. Okay, that'd be if, great. If it hasn't been burned to the ground since then, because, you know, those Potter Gaggers, <laughs> they love their explosives. They do love their explosives. Those little scamps. Oh, those little so-and-sos. <laughs> God bless them.